Okay, I just want to make this video and show you how to use an app called Capture 3D Scan Anything. And as you can tell from the title, this is a nice little app to create 3D models that you can then upload into your website. Um, anyway, so what you need to do is download or go to the App Store and then download the Capture program. Okay, so now what you need to do is open up your app and then find an object to scan. Now, I will tell you, it's a little bit difficult to do a scan with this app because you need the forward facing camera. So the, the camera that you do, say if you wanna take a selfie, um, it won't work if you turn, uh, if you use the a backwards facing camera. So what you need to do is find your object and then hit um, the start button. Now, again, it's gonna be hard to hold but you can actually do it if you, if you try. So, and then go ahead and make your first scan and then follow the next set of instructions. Okay, so what you need to do is go to your app and then click sign on. Now you get to sign on by um, clicking on this little button here. And then once you sign in, you'll see, or once you click on that, you'll see this little sign in. So you need to have an email and a password. And then once you sign in, you will see um, this little window. So you can access your scans and browser, and then you can click on that and it'll open the browser on your phone. But what I find easier to do is to um, go directly to the website where you could actually see your scans. And let me show you that in just a second. Okay, so once you sign in, you can go to www.standardcyber.com and then you can sign in to see your scans. Now, I'm, I've already signed in. So you can see the one scan um, of the cup and I'll talk about this in the next slide. Okay, once you've taken your scan and once you have uploaded it using your phone app, you would then go to the standard cyborg website and log in there and then your scan will be there. And so this is a scan of a cup, a coffee mug I took. Now, um, I mentioned this before, the way you scan is not very easy in this particular app, but it does, it does work. Um, anyway, so here's my scan cup. Now let me click on it. And then as you can see, I can move this all around. Now, I did not scan the back. Um, but you can see and um, what it did for this cup. Now, if I had been a little more careful, it would have been uh, much clearer. But you can imagine going into a museum and scanning an object um, and then having that. Now, you can download these. I haven't had very much luck in terms of uh, getting these assets, this, this is called an asset, into something like Adobe Arrow just yet. I'll, I'll keep playing with this. But you can share it. So. Um, click on the share button and you can get um, the link here and then you can add that to your website. So now you've made a, a nice little 3D object um, that can be inserted into your website and um, it's fairly easy to do, although like I said, scanning is a bit of a pain because you have to use the forward-facing camera.